Hello, great to have you with us. And this is the scene here at the Lusail Stadium, just to the north of Doha. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And both teams with one game each under their belt already. Let's see how they fare this time around. How do you see it panning out, Stuart? Well, Derek, this will be tense. Both teams know that a loss here and they'll be in terrible trouble. Let's hope it's not a cagey affair and we see some good football. Number six, Ambrose Oyango. This is how the starting lineup looks today. Well, 4 4 2 is a good formation if it's played well. It covers most of the bases defensively, and if you can then rotate your positions when you regain possession, you can also be fluid in attack. Let's hope we see that today. And the Serbia starting 11. Well, when you play in a 3 5 2 formation, the position of the wing backs is key. If they drop too deep, you can't dominate possession. And if they play too high, you leave the centre backs exposed. They have to get the balance right. And the match begins. Alexander Mitrovic. Dusan Tadic. He's got to have a go here. is moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be and providing width opportunity to deliver the cross and the referee sees that as a foul free kick given and crossing towards the far post and the problem not completely solved Able to close down the shot. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot. Milinkovic Savic. Tadic. Zivkovic. Vlaovic, determined block. And he read it well. That's not a bad ball. Well, it's off target. They were watching him like a hawk. Might be able to get in behind the defence. And played in. 
And it didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done. Toko Ekambi. Clean challenge. Room to manoeuvre on the wing. Milinkovic Savic. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. Couldn't keep it. Tadic. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Can they hit on the break? Defenders need to cover. Well, it was a superb counter-attack. Not such high marks for the finish. Well, the build-up to the shot was great. Good defending, quick transition and excellent movement. It just needed a much better finish. Kostic. Chance to do damage. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. And that pass could be troublesome. And the alarm bells are ringing. No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Milinkovic Savic. Giving it a try. And it's in! The back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Promising looking ball. And running in behind. Abubakar. Textbook defending inside the box. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Well, it came to nothing in the end. And the referee is quite rightly letting it go. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. A chance to whip it in. Well, I couldn't quite find his teammate. Making progress. An unforced error, you've got to say. Milinkovic Savic. On the offensive. Oh, fine stop. Over it comes. And did his job defensively. Well, a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Well, these stats confirm how poor their finishing has been. Their general build-up play until that final shot has been excellent. And they really should be out of sight by now. Will they live to regret it? Chance to change that, maybe, on the attacking front. 
Crossing possibilities. Happy to take on the shot. But it wasn't a taxing save. Well, he could run onto it here. Try to lob the keeper. Well, choosing to chip. And it wasn't so very far away. Well, it was good vision, excellent technique, but not quite the end result it deserved. He did well to cut it out. Ongisa losing possession. Dusan Tadic now with Mitrovic. Vlaovic. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Well, the keeper wanted to take it cleanly, and did. It might be! And a fine stop. Who's going to get on the end of it? And not cleared away properly. The first half here comes to an end. Well, a more than decent first half showing from Dusan Tadic. Stuart, what did you make of him? Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. And the match begins. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. A bit of running room now on the wing. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Simple for the keeper. Andrea Zipkovic. And the ball with Milinkovic Savic. Dusan Vlahovic. Opportunity it is. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. This looks threatening. Zivkovic. And missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that should have made it more comfortable, shouldn't it? But it's a wasted opportunity. I must say, this looks promising. Bad challenge. And now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. <laughs> Routine, really. Very effective challenge put in. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And under pressure, that was a fine claim.
there to take it away. Shupomoting. Toko Ekambi. Nemanja Gudel. Kostic has it. An unforced error, you've got to say. Abubakar. Must be! A goal! Real excitement! A back-and-forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw-in. You've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Ongisa, committed challenge. How about the cross? And just the header that was required. The goal they were in search of. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box. Just begging someone to get on the end of it. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Neutrals are getting their money's worth. 3-2 in this match. Nikola Milenkovic. Zivkovic. Vraovic. Hearted defending and the concession of a corner here. Who can they pick out? Insufficient guile from that corner. Keeper's ball. Toko Ekambi. Abubakar. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. And good pressure high up the pitch. The supporters want to see him have a go. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. So a personnel change then. And take it away. Plenty of support here. Shupamoting. Oh, a vital interception. No possibilities in the centre. The inside route looks promising. Real chance. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. Galamu. Shupomoting has it. The referee correctly decided to play advantage.
Nemanja Maksimovic. And we've entered the final five minutes. Gudel. Vraovic. This could finish it. Vigorous defending. What a vital intervention. Andre Frank Zombo Ongisa. Choupo-Moting has it. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Toko Ikombi! Oh, a goal! An equaliser in the closing stages! Well, here's the replay, and you can see why he's upset. He got something on it, but not enough to keep it out. That's frustrating for a keeper. away again we can't complain about a lack of entertainment 3-3 well adding up all the stoppages we will have two extra minutes can he put them in front able to clear the danger at least for now and an effective clearance it's all over and this one goes into the books as a draw a fiercely competitive encounter. Stuart, your thoughts on their performance? Well, Derek, it's a horrible feeling when you can see so late in the game. They thought they had the game won, but a lack of concentration has cost them dear here. Well, a standout performance, not for the first time, from Carl Toko Ekombi. Stuart, interested to know what you made of his contribution. Well, it was a good comeback, and he played a big part in that. He just kept plugging away, and in the end, he got his reward with the equaliser. Dusan Tadic.